Hi, can you believe the movie Vela Cruz was released 69 years ago? Many of us grew up attached to the TV screens. I think it would be fun if you and your family sat on the couch and watched this movie again with the entire cast of then and now. Where are these actors now? Who made it to Hollywood and who passed away? Find the answer in our video. Gary Cooper was born on May 7, 1901 in Helena, Montana, USA. He portrayed the character Benjamin Train in the film when he was 53 years old in 1954. We regret to inform you that in 1961, he passed away at the age of 60, leaving us deeply saddened. I had a little tin soldier about so high, and one day I lost it, and I cried. My mother says, stop falling, someday that soldier's bound to show up. And she was uh, are you also important in the recording field? In, in the Pardon? Henry Brandon was born on June 8, 1912, in Berlin, Germany. He portrayed the character Captain Danette in the film when he was 42 years old in 1954. We regret to inform you that in 1990, he passed away at the age of 77, leaving us deeply saddened. As a soldier, he fought with the American Confederate Army. And I fear we'll have little in common. You see, I've never fought with the losing side. The only thing is, most of the television, it's get the film in the can. And that is the first, just remember the words. And Cesar Romero was born on February 15, 1907, in New York City, USA. He portrayed the character Marcus Henry de Labrador in the film when he was 47 years old in 1954. We regret to inform you that in 1994, he passed away at the age of 86, leaving us deeply saddened. Yes. And one or two homes that once might have stood beside all this. Once. There's nothing ever destroyed that can't be re- And I did, uh, I played opposite Maureen O'Sullivan in Cardinal Richelieu with George Arliss playing the, the Cardinal. Oh, wonderful. And then I did Metropolitan there with Lawrence Tip. Burt Lancaster was born on November 2nd, 1913 in New York, USA. He portrayed the character Joe Aaron in the film when he was 41 years old in 1954. We regret to inform you that in 1994, he passed away at the age of 80, leaving us deeply saddened. Think of that. Too bad you never knew Ace Hannah. Ran a gambling joint back in Laredo. Shot my old man in the stud game when I was still a kid. Ace felt so bad he'd give me a home. Vietnam, etc. Uh, the world, unfortunately, doesn't seem to be getting better or more kindly toward its neighbor. People do use those methods to solve. Ernest Borg 9 was born on January 24, 1917, in Hampton, Connecticut, USA. He portrayed the character Donegan in the film when he was 37 years old in 1954. We regret to inform you that in 2012, he passed away at the age of 95, leaving us deeply saddened. When you let her go. You as a man, you'd get off that horse. I'll get off when you turn her loose. actor or actress in the world and he'd take his time and work with you and and bring out the thing that he wanted you know easy easy and the first thing you know Denise Darcel was born on September 8 1924 in Paris France she played the character Countess Mary Duvar in the film when she was 30 years old in 1954 we regret to inform you that in 2011 she passed away at the age of 87 leaving us deeply saddened well, I can think of many uses for it. More civilized than war. Ma'am, you're just full of surprises. Then it be out of I was in a small village, and I went back every winter. I went to Paris. Six months here, six months a peasant, six months a Parisian. Healthy. What? Sarah Montilla was born on March 10, 1928, in Campo de Criptana, Spain. She portrayed the character Nina in the film when she was 26 years old in 1954. We regret to inform you that in 2013, she passed away at the age of 85, leaving us deeply saddened. Another? That was a nice new dress you're wearing. You wouldn't turn it down, would you? It'd break a heart. Captain Danette informed me of your heroic... No, a mi mesa. Y entonces me dijo, Sara, mi hija y yo somos muy admiradoras a suyas. Nosotros quisiéramos... 
George McGrady was born on August 29, 1899, in Providence, Rhode Island, USA. He portrayed the character Emperor Maximilian in the film when he was 55 years old in 1954. We regret to inform you that in 1973, he passed away at the age of 73, leaving us deeply saddened. You consider death a handsome enough reward for them. If not from the guns of the Paristas, then perhaps from the steel of your majesty's lancers. You may Morris Engram was born on August 28, 1896, in Danville, Illinois, USA. He portrayed the character General Ramirez in the film when he was 58 years old in 1954. We regret to inform you that in 1964, he passed away at the age of 68, leaving us deeply saddened. You were saying the Emperor was extremely generous. I am sorry, senor. His Excellency is now our prisoner. Jack Lambert was born on April 13, 1920, in Yonkers, New York, USA. He portrayed Charlie in the film when he was 34 years old in 1954. We regret to inform you that in 2002, he passed away at the age of 81, leaving us deeply saddened. Anything wrong with the count? Ah. James C. was born on September 9, 1914, in Pasadena, California, USA. He portrayed Abilene in the film when he was 40 years old in 1954. We regret to inform you that in 1992, he passed away at the age of 78, leaving us deeply saddened. Information desk. Well, Dr. Martin seems to be indestructible, except for those hallucinations. Those weren't hallucinations, Colonel. Under the influence... Charles Bronson was born on November 3, 1921, in Ehrenfeld, Pennsylvania, USA. He portrayed the character Pittsburgh in the film when he was 33 years old in 1954. We regret to inform you that in 2003, he passed away at the age of 81, leaving us deeply saddened. Put him on the radiator. It's a good dry. <laughs> you talk about space. It's still hanging over a little bit. Donato and daughter with a... Jack Elam was born on November 13, 1920, in Miami, Arizona, USA. He portrayed the character Tex in the film when he was 34 years old in 1954. We regret to inform you that in 2003, he passed away at the age of 82, leaving us deeply saddened. Everything else kind of stupid. Yeah. Uh, and how did you get into acting? I know it wasn't the, your, your first choice as a profession. No, I was, I was an auditor at, in the picture. Let me know who's your favorite character from Vela Cruz and share your thoughts on the deceased actors by leaving your comments under this video. Remember to support us by liking, subscribing to the channel, and pressing the bell to receive my upcoming videos. Thank you and see you again.